what else is happening um there's a couple things i'm gonna just power through real quick uh green lantern lanterns this tv show from john james gunn in the dcu this one i believe has been greenlit to go into production now um they announced this show a while back when they announced the slate for gods and monsters for the dc universe the interesting thing about their announcement was that uh james gunn later clarified that even though he announced the projects that doesn't mean that they were greenlit. That means that they were still in early stages of development. They were just pitching ideas. Any of these projects can honestly change, or at least it feels that way, because he went out of his way to let us know that none of these projects are in development. They're, they're not even greenlit yet. So, except for maybe Lantern. So Lantern seems to be the one that is getting further along into production. Um, they're slating to begin filming Lanterns in January 2025. Uh, which is going to be a busy time for Warner Brothers because that's also when they're going to start filming them dragons again. Uh, but Lanterns is slated to begin in January 2025. They're going to try to wrap up in June of that year. With that, at that rate, probably looking for release in 2026, uh, which will be a little, you know, a year after Superman and whatever happens with that. Uh, the good news is, and the really exciting news for me is that We've got good writers. In case y'all didn't hear me, I'm going to say it again for the folks in the back. We've got good writers, y'all. Good writers. Damon Lindelof and Tom King. Now, Damon Lindelof probably needs no introduction. You guys are familiar with him, with his work with J.J. Abrams in the past, uh, working on his projects alongside J.J. Abrams almost given us a Star Wars project with Yaya Abdul-Mateen, um, gave us that fantastic Watchmen adaptation. That all came from the mind of Lindelof. But then we also have Tom King. Now, this is just a deep cut for us comic book fans. There, there's there's levels of comic book writers, right? There's, there's like the Jonathan Hickmans, the Jeff Johns, the Mark Wade's, and then we've got the Tom Kings that's like working his way up, right? He is, without a doubt, one of DC's hottest talents. He started off as for writing a Eisner Award winning series called Vision for Marvel. It was the foundation for WandaVision. So all that stuff about Vision living a domesticated life and trying to be, all that came from Tom King. They took his idea and gave it to Jack Schaefer and company, and they made a TV show out of it. But that was Tom King's idea. He also went on to DC to make some fantastic stories. I love his Batman story. I love Tom King's Batman story. I'm an avid comic book reader. This is the one to be excited about. Damon Lindelof and Tom, Tom King was teaming with Ava DuVernay to give us a story on um dark side she was going to make a movie about dark side and she tapped tom king on the shoulder to be the writer that's how good she is he is ava duvernay knew him she ain't even she wasn't even associated with comic books she's like him that's the guy trust me this is the guy i've met tom king a few times wonderful guy from the dc area he's a former uh i think it's a former fbi agent I think that's what it was, right? He was a field agent for the FBI for years. He left that job behind and decided he wanted to write comic books. But it's all to our benefit because his stories reflect his experience. Trust me, this is the one. But yeah, Green Lantern, Lanterns, I'm excited for it. Y'all don't know, this is probably my most anticipated thing coming from DC. Forget Superman, forget Brave and the Bold. I'm hyped for Lanterns. Uh, but I'm excited to see what other people think of this when it comes out. Uh, this this is going to be an interesting one. Uh, real 